Hi guys, welcome to another video. Today we're going to test out the weld assist settings on the Kempi 235. I have this Certiflat stand that I'm going to weld and I've never welded mild steel on this machine. This I think will be a great test for the weld assist feature. This is a heavy duty kit. I also have some light duty kits that I'm going to be assembling later, so we'll test it again in another video uh, when, we, when we set those up. I'm not super excited about this because the parts are so filthy. Got the first leg and cross brace fit to the bench. Now, we're gonna go menu, weld assist. We're doing a ferrous metal. This is two mil thick. We're gonna do two different kinds of weld. Initially, I'm gonna do an inside corner weld. I'm gonna set it to vertical. The information the machine spits out is 117 amps, seven liters a minute, which is something that we set on the regulator. Uh, 2.4 millimeter tungsten with a 1.6 mil filler and it's estimating a 130 millimeter per minute travel speed. Right now I have a number 18 torch. I'm just fitting a 2% lanthanated tungsten with a 30 degree grind. Typically this is what I use for aluminium. I'm just doing about an 8 inch stick out and we're going to set it to seven liters per minute. Didn't think I had any mild steel filler on, but I do. I've got some uh, ER70S6. Packed really well. I'm going to go through and get these all tacked up and then I'll go ahead and reset the machine when we go to do the final weld. Now let's check out the inside corner joints. Go to previous, we're going to inside corner joint. Our position looks like This PB, I don't know what A, B, C, D, E, F, G stand for, if anything. Obviously, it's the alphabet and consecutive. So it's upping the amperage to 124, sticking at the 7 litres a minute, uh, sticking the same electrode, and it's giving me 125 millimetres a minute. I'm going to bring you guys in with the GoPro, hopefully. the final inside corner joint. I think the weld assist feature is amazing on this job. Two millimeter mild steel. All I did was put in the metal type, the thickness and the joint that I'm trying to do and the machine was dialed in well enough for me to make very decent welds. Certainly got full penetration and certainly got good quality welds. A little bit of fine tuning to improve aesthetics but 
all in all, to have a machine that gives you a ballpark right out of the box, I think is bloody awesome. I've got some more videos coming for the Kempi 235 and I'm very excited to show you guys those. Thank you guys for making it to the end. If you like what I'm doing here, why not subscribe? Check out some of my other videos. I'm making stuff all the time in this shop. And as always, I'm gonna see you in the next one.